This is the test setup for my Vulcan DVR. I have a dial indicator with one inch of travel to measure the downward movement of the spindle. I have the downfeed attachment set up to positively move the spindle in the down and upward direction. Demonstration. And we'll be watching the display that is showing some inconsistencies in readings with the actual spindle movement. The spindle is in the full up position. I'm going to press the zero button. And the first problem I'm observing is that I can't get zero. It reads minus 0 0.002 inches. I'm going to be turning the down feet handle, and you'll be seeing this rotate also, and I will call out the actual spindle movement. So, turning down ten thousandths of an inch, no change, twenty thousandths of an inch, no change, spindle downward movement is twenty thousandths, thirty thousandths, forty thousandths, Notice it's 0.025 now, 50 thousandths, 0.027. Now watch 0.027, 60 thousandths, no change at all. 70 thousandths, no change at all. 80 thousandths, and it just jumped up. 90 thousandths, and one tenth of an inch. So that's the inconsistent behavior that I'm seeing in the first approximately one-tenth of an inch of spinward down, spindle downward travel. I'm now one-tenth of an inch down with the spindle. Let me just re-zero this to show you what happens. Once I'm at this position and lower with the spindle, I do get a reading of 0, 0.000, and now let me advance ten thousandths, Twenty thousandths, thirty thousandths, forty thousandths, fifty thousandths, sixty thousandths, seventy thousandths, eighty thousandths, ninety thousandths, and another tenth of an inch. Notice it followed it very well. Again, let me do the zero and as I would expect anywhere where you press zero, we are getting zero with slight fluctuations in the very last digit, but we are getting very close to zero.